Hi everyone, this is Kini. Welcome to Expert Asia Academy. Now, in this video, we will discuss about the electromotive force and internal resistance of the batteries and cells. First, we should know about the what is electric cells and batteries. What is electric cells and batteries? See, and Electric cell converts chemical energy into electrical energy to produce electricity. So what is the electric cell? It converts chemical energy into electrical energy to produce electricity. It contains two electrodes, carbon and G. It contains two electrodes. Electrodes means terminals. You must be an electrolyte. Sulfuric acid, sulfuric acid. See here. This is the one of the cell. These two rods indicates electrodes. This is the positive electrode. I mean terminal. This is the negative terminal. This positive terminal is carbon electrode. This is zinc electrode. These two electrodes are immersed in electrolyte that is sulfuric acid. That is sulfuric acid. Several electric cells connected together form a battery. Several electrical cells connect together form a battery. When a cell or battery is connected to a circuit, Electrons flow from the negative terminal to the positive terminal through circuit. By using chemical reactions, a battery produces potential difference across its terminals. So whenever you arrange the cells together, it forms a battery. This battery it contains the electrons. This battery mobilizes the electrons. These electrons are traveling from negative terminal of the battery to positive terminal of the battery to the circuit. By using this chemical reaction, these batteries, I mean cells, produces the potential differences. This potential differences provides the energy to move the electrons through the circuit. So cells are produces potential differences. This potential difference is used to Move the electrons from negative terminal of the battery to positive terminal of the battery to the circuit. So, this is the information about the electric cell. So, simply what is the meaning of electric cells? Electric cell, it is nothing but a, it converts the chemical energy into electrical energy, produce electricity. So, this is the electric cells and battery. Next, electromotive force and internal resistance. Electromotive force and internal resistance. First, see about electromotive force. A battery or cell is called a source of electromotive force. Battery or cell, it is a source of electromotive force. The term electromotive force is a misnomer since it does not really refer to a force. It's not a force, but describes a potential difference in words. Describes a potential difference in words. That means potential difference or EM. Potential difference is produced by what is done on charge by using the electric force by using the electric force coming to the electromotive force it's not a real force it is also a potential difference here also what is done against on the charge by using the chemical force which is given by batteries or cells in EMF Chemical forces creates the work on the charge. 
in potential difference electrical forces creates the work against and the charge so this is the difference between emf and potential difference coming to internal resistance a battery is made of electrodes and electrolytes there is a resistance to flow of charges within the battery the flow of charges within the battery this resistance is called internal resistance definitely battery is made up of electrodes and electrolytes there is a resistance to flow of charges within the battery compulsory there is a resistance inside the battery this inside resistance of the battery is called internal resistance okay so what is the relation between this electromotive force and internal resistance look at here generally from ohm's law v is equal to ir you know this relation by using this v is equal to ir i is equal to v by r i is equal to v by r so here v is the voltage on the battery look at this circuit a b c d this is battery this is resistor this is also resistor here capital e represents the electromotive force on the battery i is the current it is traveling from plus terminal on the battery to this resistor and it is entered through this resistor it stops at i to terminal on the terminal make to terminal on the battery minus okay. here i is equal to capital e divided by capital r plus small r so why here entering like this actually from ohms law i is equal to v by r okay. at the case of v we are entering here capital e so here potential difference is in volts so that's why potential difference that is equal to emf emf symbol is e actually that is epsilon we are entering capital e so no problem for that capital e divided by capital r plus small r resistance of the resistor and the internal resistance of the battery i is equal to e divided by capital r plus small r R capital E is equal to I into capital R plus one. The potential difference of this cell. So here V is the potential difference A and D. That is equal to E minus I R. Capital E minus I R. Okay. Next potential difference between B and C. Potential difference between B and C. That is I R. So why we are entered capital E minus I R. Here only I R. This is the EMF. This is the R. potential difference with internal resistance potential difference with internal resistance okay e minus i r in between a and d a and d okay at b and c potential difference that is equal to i r so finally v is equal to e minus ir that is equal to ir so here v is less than e by the amount equal to fall of potential inside the cell due to its internal resistance this is the right statement v is less than why because internal resistance is there the right so from the above ir is equal to Capital E minus B, and I R is equal to B. Here, dividing these two, I R divided by I R, small R divided by capital R, that is equal to B minus B divided by B. So small R is equal to capital R into B minus B divided by capital R. This equation relates capital E B. And internal resistance R in the circuit of external resistance capital. 
So this is the relation between capital R, that is external resistance, capital E, electric field, potential difference V, and internal resistance, small r. So in this video, we discussed about the two concepts, that is electric cells and batteries at the same time, electromotive force and internal resistance. So thanks for watching this video. For more videos, visit www.expertizeracademy.com.